night, an ice skating instructor is recovering at this hour at home after being stabbed. 34-year-old Emma Baxter is an instructor for the Hamilton Center Ice Arena in Columbus. Well, Friday morning, she showed up to work, and minutes later, she tells us a stranger randomly attacked her in the parking lot. Fox 59's Lindsay Eaton walks us through what happened. This is 34-year-old Emma Baxter. She's a talented ice skater. She spent years with Disney on Ice and skating in Spain. Here in Columbus, Emma is a very popular instructor. She, she's great. She is wonderful with the kids. We actually have kids from outside of the Bartholomew County area that request her, so they come in from outside of the county to just be with Emma. On Friday morning around 6.30, Emma showed up for a lesson at the Hamilton Center Ice Arena. Here in the parking lot is where an encounter with a stranger turned violent. The man approached her in the parking lot, asked for a, a cigarette, and when uh, uh, she told him no, um, uh, she got back into her vehicle and tried to get away. However, the, uh, the suspect crashed into her vehicle a short time later uh, in a stolen car. Police say the man, Ryan Halligan, then stabbed Emma. She even dialed uh, um, 911 to, uh, in an attempt to get uh, officers here. And uh, one of the saving graces was that uh, this happened right around our shift change. And we had a uh, CPD patrol officer here just moments after getting the, uh, the 911 calls. Police say as soon as officers showed up, the suspect took off running over this bridge. They found him hiding near a home and arrested him. Since the attack, park officials tell us they are now looking to add extra security measures. Do we need extra lighting? Do we need extra security cameras? So we're looking at all those options. Mark Jones is the director of the Columbus Parks and Rec. This ice rink is a busy place for families and young skaters. A little, little shocking, scared. After spending days in the hospital, Emma is now home recovering. Her ice skating family realizes she has a long road ahead, but they want her to know she's missed. Employee, we love her. I know her kids really miss her. All of her, her students miss her, so we can't wait to get her back. In Columbus, Lindsay Eaton, Fox 59 News. Halligan's charges will be up to the prosecutor's office. As for Emma, if you're interested in helping her, we have posted some information attached to the story. You will find it at fox59.com.